As early as Wednesday, the red carpets were laid out in the north and rear entrance of Batasan Pambansa, where Duterte will enter. The Presidential Security Group has also activated its task force for this year's sauna. They will conduct routine and random inspections at the venue. The PSG also held a simulation exercise with the AFP and PNP last July 9. Around 350 guests will be allowed to physically attend the program, a big increase from last year's maximum capacity of 50 people. The Batasang Pambansa complex has been placed under lockdown starting today until Sunday. Strict security and health protocols will be implemented. Sana attendees need to be fully vaccinated and have a negative RT-PCR test result ready. They will undergo antigen testing upon arrival in Batasan on Monday. Guests will be seated one seat apart during the speech. So far, around 120 to 130 members of Congress confirmed their attendance while other VIPs chose to attend via Zoom. Okay, mga deputy speakers natin, darating former speaker, darating din. Sa mga senators natin, I think parang sampu atak na confirm na. Uh, yung iba via Zoom na lang eh. Via Zoom, si GMA, iminte lang namin yung kay, ano, yung kay uh, President Era. Si, si Ma'am Lenny, uh, nag-confirm siya via, ano, via Zoom na siya. Pop singer Morissette Amon will be singing the national anthem. RTVM director Danny Abad will direct this year's sauna. Program organizers said that President Duterte's last State of the Nation address will be modest and memorable. Congress expressed support for Duterte's priority bills once the third regular session resumes next week. For News 5, Marian Enriquez, we are One News.